Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. It is a calm, beautiful night out. Ah, just look at it. I didn't have to wait outside for it to turn night this time. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do here to start off the part is warp back over to the Sacred Grove and get that dang final pole in the Sacred Grove area that has been tormenting me for the longest time now. <sighs> so you go over here. And then you go through here. Back where the Master Sword rested. I told you what this was before. And look! There it is! There it is! It's here! And I have it! <laughs> Finally, this place is complete. All right, so now what you actually I'll show you the map before I get into this a little further You'll notice at the Kokeriko area. There's two symbols for some reason this one down here Doesn't disappear even though you've already been there before but what we have to do is go over to this one next So I gotta find the closest warp point to wherever that is Ooh. Ooh. Uh, I guess here will do. It's pretty far away, so I gotta hoof it the rest of the way. I suppose I could use a no pay, but I think it would take more time to call her than it would to, <laughs> you know, actually get her. Well, no, maybe not. By the way, notice that there's a statue over there. That's for something a little bit later, once I get the Dominion Rod back in tip-top shape so anyway you just go through here follow this path keep going keep going it's a long trek I know well, okay it's not that long but I think this is the first time I've been through here when you know there wasn't twilight around the area so this is the first time you've ever seen this area you know in its normal state don't jump off there by the way <laughs> um, this is the place I'm supposed to go but oops I would kind of like... You know what? I'll show you the rest later. Let's just go through. Ow! <laughs> go, 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 go! <laughs> so, if you've ever been through here before by a mistake, and you found that it was blocked off, well... Not anymore! Oh, I gotta turn back into my normal human self before... Really? Seriously? I gotta do it out. Fine. <laughs> I think we, like the Gorons would be more used to stuff like this, but whatever. So we're back as a human out here, and now let's go inside. <laughs> now let's chat with him, and the moment we chat, well, the moment we go near him, he finishes his work, and there we go. Thank you very much. Uh-oh. This, this next place, it is... Just amazing. I mean in a hilarious way. You'll see what I mean when I get there. Yeah, there's there's a lot of enemies coming up. But, th but this is just so funny. I, I, <laughs> I just couldn't believe this when I first seen it. Got it! And that is typically what my strategy is anyway. So before you go into this area, you probably, probably want to get out your claw shot as well as the bow, and I already got that out, actually. <laughs> so that's pretty handy. Alright, let's get the bow out. Let's do it. Western shootout time! <laughs> I, I just could not believe this when I first seen it. I love this game so much. There's so many silly moments like this throughout the game, as well as awesome stuff serious epic moments with oh my god this is just unbelievably awesome I did not expect this at all so we got 20 enemies in this area I'm going to try and shoot them all before they see me just as he said wow they're just blowing themselves up <laughs> the bow is very very handy for doing this you're gonna need the claw shot to get to the uh, upper levels in certain areas uh, can I shoot out the window yeah I can there is a Howling Stone around this area as well. Um, I'll get that a little bit later though. I think... 
I mean, it would be, be a little safer, you know, when there's no enemies around this area. <laughs> uh, I'm going to sneak through here and see if there's any more to clear out in this area. I'm gonna stay in the cover, so to speak, because the house itself provides nice cover, I suppose. Uh, can I? No, I can't break that, but I can go out this window. I... Oh! He's up here. No, 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 poop, oh, poop, oh, poop. <laughs> Alright, 13 more to go. Oh, 12. Oh, 11. I guess it took a while for the counter to update. <laughs> this is just too awesome for words. And I can just attack you normally. I'm too close to the crates. It's too bad. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. And whoa, whoa, where did that come from? Seen that? Oh, oh, you're up there, huh? You're up there, huh? Actually, where are you? <laughs> wait, 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 is that a, him right there? Too close to the crate again. It certainly looks like it would be... Why are they shooting me from the window? Oh, that's... hmm. <laughs> ah. Okay, there's definitely one... Yeah, that is one over there, so how was I missing them, I swear? Maybe the enemy's hitboxes are a lot smaller than I thought they were, but whatever, it's, it's dead. We can go on. <laughs> As you can tell, this is an abandoned town. Well, aside from this, uh... Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez! This group of thugs here that have been... Causing the only good denizen of this town quite a lot of ire. You'll see once I clear this place out. I got plenty of arrows to do this. Thanks to that upgrade back at the tent. Oh jeez. You're going down. Ah, that's good enough. <laughs> I'm being a little bit reckless, but it's working out anyway. Probably because I have 14 hearts. I've been collecting a crazy amount of stuff, and I even gotta go and backtrack to do other stuff, so... Oh! Well, you're not the threat, you're the threat. You're just there. You're just there, standing at the table for no reason. I blocked that shot with pure luck. <laughs> and how did I miss you? Alright, one more to go. Somewhere. Right. Wherever he is, I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. where did that come from? So I might be able to shoot it from wherever... What is that up there? I don't know. <laughs> okay, where are you? Oh, 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 aha! Hiding in the alleyways, huh? Didn't work out for you, though. The Howling Stone is uh, towards the right side, by the way. Of this place, so... Oh, oh, hello there. Little old lady? Her name is Impaz. And she's the good one that I was talking about. Uh, we've never met before. How do you know? <laughs> ah, whatever. Probably shouldn't question that. Or maybe there's more to her than meets the eye. That's it, basically. She knows me from... Well, not ancient times, but through the lores and legends, basically. And she knows someone we know. Uh, that might be me. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. Yet. <laughs> hmm. Oh, Kidoki. And I got Ilya's charm. Yeah, she knows Ilya. So Ilya was through here at one time. Or at least she met her at one time. Excuse me. So now we gotta go show this to Ilya. 
No problem. All right. So let's go do that. I'll do the Howling Stone thing later because once you know, once I do the Howling Stone, what I'll you know I'll have to. Oh come on. <laughs> what I'll have to do is um. I just gotta find a place to hide here to transform and warp out. Oh come on, seriously? Seriously? If I do the Howling Stone now, as I keep interrupting myself, fine, I'll leave the village. The um, I'll have to go to another place after that, and it's kind of out of the way. And yeah, I'd rather have it in its own part rather than me just jumping from one random spot to another, so to speak. All right, can I? Can I warp here? Can I warp? What's wrong with this place? <laughs> it's, apparently that is not far enough away. Now, warp to Kakariko. <laughs> yes! Dang it! <laughs> Never before have I had so much trouble. And there's only one lady here. There's, there's no one else. The animals in this area do not care about my transforming. <laughs> Alright, hide around the corner. Back to a human. <laughs> Item out. And back in this place. Maybe that's why that mark on the map didn't disappear just yet, because I gotta go back here. But I would think that I would just, you know, use the marks to show where to go in order and, you know, put the mark back over here later. Alright, what do you have to say to this? It was. I will. Even though it is pretty much useless at this point in the game. <laughs> it's known as the horse call. It's like horse grass, but anytime. But now that I can warp pretty much anywhere, I haven't been using an Ope a lot, like, at all anymore. <laughs> But I will keep it as a memento. And dust it off every once in a while. <laughs> Alright. So now that I have this. That was a little bit more, I guess. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. A rod, huh? Hmm, I wonder what we should show that lady. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> so back in this house, you'll find her once again. I'll just talk to her really quick here. And yeah, she's doing good, but uh, oh geez, look at this. I figured out the puzzle all by my little self. 
<laughs> By the way, there's cats all over the place now. It's it's kind of weird, but they're actually a part of a little side quest in this area. I mean, there's a lot of cats, so maybe it's a reference to her being like some sort of crazy cat lady or something like that. <laughs> a book, huh? Does that mean that she can now leave this place? <laughs> now I gotta go show this to someone who will actually know how to read it. Now, who would that be? Hmm. Actually, I'll talk to you one more time before I cut over to the next spot. Back in Renato's basement. I gotta show the book to this guy. Well, I have connections, and yeah, let's just say that. <laughs> okay. His chanting is a little creepy. No reaction, huh? Is that so? Well, that may have did something, so to speak. So now he's gonna leave and look at the spots on the map that he marked on our map. But wait, wait, what just happened here? Those were the words to restore the Dominion Rod! So while it seemed like it didn't do anything, it actually did do something. It restored the Dominion Rod. Yep. So there are four of these things. Wait, four, four or six. Hold on, I'm just gonna check this really quick. There's. Uh, let's see. Oh my. Um, hmm. Are those the spots he's marked on the map, or...? I don't remember how many marks there are, actually, but we gotta go check them out, and I think I am going to do that in the next part. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you then.